Good morning to JVU and all those looking at potentially coming to JVU. My name is Drew. I'm a junior here and JVU has asked me to um, just take the gram for the day and I'm just kind of walk you through um, what a, a day looks like for me. And so we're starting here pretty early. It's currently 5.16. Um, but yeah, stay tuned, should be a good day. I'll explain in a little bit why I'm up so early, but it's looking like it's gonna be a full day. So uh, stay tuned, I'll try and be behind the camera more than um, more than I would probably choose to normally. Um, uh, so here we are, uh, what time is it? 6.17 in uh, Fayetteville, and you know, people are gonna tell you that friendships all change and that traditions don't stay, but um, if any, anyone to tell you differently, here we are with the Marjorie Jackson and the McKenna Bender. Um, we're here at Chick-fil-A tradition that we've done ever since freshman year. Yeah, freshman year. Yeah. First First semester, fall. Freshman semester. We come here during the week. I don't know what we were thinking as freshmen, but um, yeah, we come here when it opens and we just talk and catch up. So. Same booth every time. So we're gonna eat, but happy happy Tuesday, everybody. <laughs> Sweet. <laughs> so here we're at we're in class now. Uh, this is Trey. He's hey. gonna give us a pitch on uh, JBU nursing. It's awesome. Oh, there it is. <laughs> One of the best professors in in the building. The director, actually. Director. Everybody, everybody say hi to Instagram. <laughs> so here we have uh, Luke McElvain, aka the uh, best roommate on campus. And uh, why don't you tell our followers what's uh, where we're going? Well, on this uh, beautiful day, we're going to be heading to the chapel, the Ozarks, and just take a quick peek at all the all the beautiful people coming out. Um, yeah, see how it goes. It's going to be good. Wait, wait, wait. Okay, all right, go, go, go. We're here selling shirts for the basketball team. Come and for February Cancer Awareness, come get your t-shirt. Five dollars, you get a free wristband that says Onward Sore. Ooh. In the student center. We'll be here. Right and here. Today and tomorrow. Mm -hmm. Sweet. Come by. Cash only. And this is courtesy of the basketball team, correct? Yes. Did you say that? Yes. Okay, sweet. What is up, guys? We're here at ground floor. Uh, swing by, get some coffee. It's a great day, nice and cold out. Uh, grab some Joe. Good stuff. Indoor soccer class. class. All right. It's fun. I have heard also that it is fun, but racquetball definitely a go-to. So it turns out um, soccer coaches here don't just work their players on the field, but also on the racquetball court. This is a very fun pastime. Good to get away from school. From Kathleen Paulson. Take my racquetball class. Take my I also asked today what um, some of my favorite extracurricular activities were, 
and um, club volleyball. Uh, it's pretty much open gym twice a week. Um, and we have been competitive in the past. Um, but yeah, this is definitely just a good, fun time to just get out of school and um, just play and have fun. And intramurals is another one, and I'll put a video of that later. I will play in a bit, but definitely a lot of options of things to do as far as clubs and um, sports go. Um, but yeah. So another great thing here at JBU that we have is intramurals. <laughs> Give us uh, your honest opinion on uh, intramurals and how great it is for the community. Uh, <laughs> Taylor, I mean. <laughs> <laughs> you get some good exercise, like community, you know? I've attended slash been in every single one of them thus far. And I just uh, <laughs> definitely a place where you find friends and um, just let loose. Yes, you know. It's been yes, yes. It's a very good place to meet people and uh, also relieve some stress. <laughs> um, yeah, intramural intramurals. Intramurals is um, a ton of fun. And, and there you have it. A uh, day in the life of me. Definitely a long day, but I uh, hope it was informative and fun to follow. So, see you around. So, um, we'll get to those. What's up, Instagram? I am back. Um, it's not a takeover today, but I did have some questions yesterday that I wasn't able to answer, so... I'm going to try and do those now that I have some time here in the Sheets Isle of Walmart. 